Alrighty. What up, good people? Good people of the Imperial City. Welcome to the arena. <laughs> I got that shit stuck in my head. But yeah, we're back with the uh, good old Arcania. Or Arcania. I don't know. But yeah, uh, last time I failed or we died, uh, I, I did this thing up here and didn't do that. But my goal was to go here. I think we really took care of that goblin cave problem thing that that lady had. So that's all done with. Uh, I think I did that this morning or last night or something like that. Yep. Well, yep, your man gotta get up early tomorrow. I got another overtime day just like last weekend. So, yep. But it's kind of neat though. I've been playing Arcania on and off for like the last like, month or so now. So, my overall opinion of the game, I want to rate it like maybe 4.8 out of 5. Like, I, I like the game quite a bit. But I, I did hear all of this already. Yep, excuse me, sir. Yep. I think last time we saw like that gator for the first time over here. So, maybe this time we might head to the left. Just because it's different. And whatever I see, I will probably kill it because I'm in that kind of mood. Like, even if it's difficult, I'm going to suffer through it because I want XP. I want to get so strong that nothing else can get in my way. And so I'm basically going to be grinding to some degree, but I'm also going to be actually playing the game. Let's see if I can get this guy to distance himself from his little friends. Okay. And we'll say that plan worked pretty good. Nice. I'm almost tempted to go in like a full vanquisher mode. I, d I did say I would eventually do that, but I wasn't sure if I would record it or not. But so far with Arcania, I've been showing absolutely everything that I do. So I'm almost tempted just to do that. Nice. Two shots of the air with that. Let's do one more. Because we can. Since the bow is very close in damage to my sword now, or well, they're almost kind of sort of equal, it's quite easy just to get away with a lot uh, in general. That's quite nice. Uh, let's see. I remember there being those flies around. Let's see, what's this way? So that's like a whole different place probably. It might even be the location of the other quest that we were supposed to go to. Oh, oh that was the plant? That little fucking hokey doke? <laughs> Alright. I would have never have thought that was pick upable. And uh, where am I going? Woodcutter's Vale. And we'll stop by that orc village at some point. Just for now, I just feel like going somewhere that's not there. It's like if I end up completing the other half of the quest early, like I clear out a whole area and blah 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 or whatever. I don't mind. I I'm I'm in a very weird mood. As I said, like I'm in like vanquisher mode where I want to go everywhere and kill absolutely everything. What, what, do, what do I do if I do this? Oh, we get to make the wood. So do I actually get tree parts from that, or am I just doing stuff? Huh. So I kind of wonder if they're adding things to my inventory over time, or... Is something else happening? There's a chest here. Uh -huh. Compare that to my gauntlets. Let's see, 15 health, 2 health regeneration. Yeah, the other one's definitely better, so we'll just sell that. Yep. Uh, so this place is just a dead end, huh? That's kind of a letdown. I mean, I know that the rest of the biome kind of goes on and on and on, which I don't mind. But, yeah. So we got my healing. 
That's right, after I died, I got really, really prepared. Hi, Sylvester. Hey, buddy. Hello. I greet you. Hi. This cat loves my pet so much that, like, he almost falls to the ground every time I pet him. <laughs> it's because he, he, he automatically goes into rub my belly mode just from, like, a little touch. I remember when he was younger, like, you know, it was like any cat, you know, you gotta work him up a little bit to get that trust, but now my cat trusts me so much, it's just like, yes, I require petting. <laughs> I mean, I guess it makes sense, because I've known him for, like, 16, 17 something years, like, he was born when I was 11, and I'm 27 now, so, that should say a lot. Yeah, but he's... He's been around for a while, and I've been around for a while, too. But in a way, you can kind of say we grew up together. So, I mean, the fact that I'm, for the most part, responsible. Uh, it's these guys. Sons of bitches. And there's a lot, too. Ah, damn. Hoy, 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 hoy. Oh, do I have to fight this guy? Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Woo. They kind of turned there, too. Haha. -ha. Jeez. My man's just throwing ultimate moves like every turn. Good God. There we go, holy shit. Alright, so I got some kind of special necklace from him. I can see why they were worth killing. Like, I was actually debatable in doing that when I uh, first came across them, but now I'm a little bit like, ah, oh, it's a good thing I did then. <laughs> I'm happy that I'm a little bit more confident with finding these bugs all at once. Let's see. 20 armor, 15 armor. Yeah, the other necklace is better still. Yep. Uh, do what we gotta do, right? Let's, let's get this guy. Let's actually try to pick off this one first. Oh, you son of a bitch. Let's see if I can lure him. Ah! Damn it. There we go. Are they both coming? Oh shit. Let's see if I can maybe. <laughs> Get wrecked. Sound like there was another one for a minute there. Let's see if I can pick off this guy. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. Wow. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let me try to do that guy. Like I said, this bow is pretty fucking good. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Wow. I feel like a badass today. I don't know what it is. I mean, it's Friday. It's just fucking shredding today. <laughs> Let's see how much. Yeah, this video's only gone for nine minutes. Sweet. Got plenty of recording time. Oh, but yeah, we picked up a uh, long range weapon. Oh, that's it? 14? That's like half as much damage as my current sword. So these guys are out here shredding me with weapons that aren't, that aren't, aren't even that great. So I guess that means that just biologically they're fucking advanced as balls. That they have the combat skill of the gods. Oh, there's multiple of these fucking bugs. Let's do one more shot. Hopefully this will kind of, yep, fucking melt them. 
Oops, this guy. Oh great, we got two of them, huh? Kinda. Do one more. Now it's nice. Nice. This is a lot going way better than when I first got out here. Also, we're gonna have to fight these guys, aren't we? I really would rather not fight all of them at once. Oh, there's another blood flag loot. Let's see, maybe I can grab up at least one of them. Ah, shit bag. already. Oh shit! Oh! 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 And that's the regular- Oh shit! Ah oh, damn. I'll stick to the bow, thank you. <laughs> Sounds like I'm connecting my shots. This almost seems like I'm not. It's probably because there's so many. Oh, fuck. I refuse to die. Yeah. I need the big guy to go. Yeah, there we go. Might be able to fight him kind of now. Oh. There we go, hell yeah. Ooh. Bandage. Try to save my healing a little bit. I was wild though, I did not think that fight was gonna be that rough. Damn. Alright, so here's the other guy. See a weapon nearby maybe. Yeah, this fella nice. Wow. <laughs> That was uh, that was a very intense battle. I'm actually surprised I didn't maximize my level. Shit. I'm sure y'all can see why I'm having a good time now, right? <laughs> awesome. Let's see. We got a hunting arrow now. So this is range power. We got 200 of them, so I could probably use that for now since uh, we have 76 regular ones left. Uh, let's see. No. Uh, no, uh, bracer, no, what else do we have? So I guess everything that I equip goes to the top, probably. Let's see, we're good on healing items, uh, yeah, this I would go with I did not collect that much loot. Yeah. Just felt like we did, but then we didn't. It's strange, it's a strange situation. Um, but yep, I definitely don't feel like doing that fight again, so since I got my timer on, I can certainly, you know, save and do whatever I want, you know, blah, blah, blah. Oh, this guy again. Let's see. Oh. Now, these bows are a lot stronger than my other ones, so I imagine I'll be fighting a lot better. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, okay. Excuse me, sir, coming through. I'll take that again. But yeah, thank goodness for my stopwatch, though. I'll be able to do a lot with that. Maybe they got different loot in here now. Nice. Let's see. Oh, a little bit different, yeah. It's not the exact same stuff every time. It's not bad. I mean, it still kind of sucks because I think the other one was just... It had good stats, but it wasn't as good as what we currently had. But I, I did reverse of what um, I was up to. It's like, I, whatever I did the other day, I just did the opposite. 
so let's see here. So this one has stamina regen, mana, 8 health instead of 15. Has 10 armor that has 6 armor. Uh, melee power, 2 versus 3. Health regen is 2, and this one's also 2. So yeah, my current stuff is better. And see, that one's for mana. So if I was a magic user, that would be up my alley, but I'm not. Uh, this one's also trash. This one's trash. So yeah, once again, everything we currently got is better. Damn it. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and save. Yeah. Alrighty, and we're back. Let's see if I can't talk to him anymore. I imagine those patrols are probably gone for a time. So that'll be good. Let's go fight this uh, stupid fly beetle thing. My, my bow should be a lot stronger though. I should have like god tier to destruction now compared to what we were doing. And if we were kicking ass with that, like it should be even better. But it looked like it was doing the exact same shit. Oh well. Maybe just range power maybe it doesn't increase damage maybe it just I don't know increases the range something with stuff uh, but yeah, let's talk to this guy again uh huh skaboos yeah let's see what he has to say I uh, can't just barge on in there, huh? That would have been kind of cool, though. Let's know where are those beetles at. Ah, here we are. Yep, so I'm going to explore this area a little bit. Let's see. Let's go for this guy. I imagine that both of them... Oh, no, look at that. I actually got a little bit of freedom here. I get to fight one at a time. So I judge it by that encounter with this one, the next one that's kind of semi ready to fight me. He'll do the exact same shit, but the other one won't interfere. Look at that, he's ready, but he's not coming. That little bit of distance I put between us has really helped out. I love messing with AI like this. <laughs> it's just like, I'm so happy you're not smart. Because at normal games, like, you know, a smart, like, Skyrim smart, like, there, there could be one necromancer, and he, if you don't kill him, he will chase you until you die. Or until you get out of range in some way from the sight. This game, though, it's like, if you run away from something, they have a little station that they stay at, and if you go far enough, and even if they're right behind you, they'll run back to their spot. What the? What? Oh, shit! Wow. Came charging at me from behind. Wow. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Thanks for the heart attack. So is there... Ah, mana plant. Uh-huh. I'm sure a guy like me who doesn't rely on magic would probably be like a, a magician's best friend. I would have so much... <laughs> I would have so much stuff for you guys. Like, if anyone watching this video is like a mage... And you're like, fuck, man, I wish he would use this stuff. If this game was co-op in some way, like, I would invite you to my game and just trade you my stuff. I'd be like, here you go. And if you got, like, some cool sword or something, something then awesome. Like, that's a fair trade. Like, yeah, give me some very strong armor yeah, in exchange. I don't know. Let's see. Uh, uh, so I, ch I checked over here already. It looks like I have to go back. It says probably get the skaboos. I think. I don't, I don't know if that's the exact. Oh! Well, I saw that shit, man. Man, there's so many of you. Oh my god. I'm gonna risk it all and try to, like, slash them all at once. Uh, 
Determination. Hiya. <laughs> Don't fuck with me. <laughs> I'm not in the same mood as yesterday. I'm a fucking conqueror today. And the thing that they were just right, right down the road. The snapper weed. Uh, whipper snapper. But yeah, I don't think that these guys have like a super fast respawn time, I would think. So hopefully when I run back, you know, we'll be, we'll be alright. I don't have to do all this again. So I think things stay permanently dead as long as you're there. So like if I run across the whole map, like I imagine everything should stay dead. I think. Uh, you just have anything new to say. <sighs> alright. So be it. I do like the uh, difficulty of this game, though, that it like, kind of gives. And I imagine this game would feel a lot more different if I wasn't playing max difficulty because I have such a high opinion of it because it gives me challenge. But this isn't actually how the game is. This is the most difficult version of the game. And this is like gothic or whatever that uh, difficulty setting was. I forget. But yes, hello Mr. Armorsmith. Greetings. Boy to the Manoy. Yes. yes, but I'm not responsible for its condition. Why, my anvil! What's that smell? What happened, lad? I just on it. want to know, believe me. Is it useless? Let's see. Oh, what a shame. Most of it is lost. Ah, but here. I can teach you this. And then it gives me Let's a recipe it, that I can sell. Better hurry. Huh. <laughs> Alright. That's a lot of stuff. Uh, but yep, since he's kind of a smith, let's go check out what he got. Some good stuff, but just not for me. Let's see. Uh -huh. It's all the same shit. Okay. Yep, we're gonna go through my list and make my money. I, I think I bought something from him, or I, I, I think we bought something else. I don't remember. Uh, let's see, hunting arrow, heavy bolt. Okay. Didn't we have two crossbows? No. Alright, uh, what else we got? Something I can never, uh, I can't. Oh, I can drop it though. So I can, I can drop those things that have been weighing me down. Alright, at least encumbrance isn't a deal, but if it was, I would probably, you know, get rid of that and shit. Uh, but yeah, let's get rid of that. This thing, I think we said no. Same deal with that, it was just copy. No. So I want to make sure, like, I'm not being given something and that I end up selling that. That would kind of suck. Let's see, man, I have health. Stamina and melee, don't want that. Mana and magic power, no. Mana and magic power, no. Stamina, no. Let's get rid of all these. Uh huh, and we'll get rid of that. Aha! Uh -huh. So let's go see if Skaboos might be on the inventory here. Have you, not yet. Have you found the palm weed? What? Hello. Hmm. Like, I don't think she would have something of that sort, I don't believe, but uh, I might be wrong. Let's see. Ruby, healing potion. So Skaboos would start with an S. I don't see any of that, so alright, whatever. I, I'm just gonna go on a whim here and say that we have to go like super, super far out there from where we're at. Yeah, that or I have to head upward, like, you know, towards where this little exclamation point is, but for now, I suppose we'll just explore the southern biome. Why not? Let's see, I've been recording for 20 minutes. Before I keep going, though, if you don't mind, I will check if my girlfriend messaged me or not. Because I, I forget if I said that I would record... Um, uh, let's see. Oh, 
on me or not. I think she probably got enough things to distract him anyway. And I, I don't mind doing Okami tomorrow. I can always do that. But, you know, maybe I'll do a late night thing. I'm not sure. We'll see. When it, when it comes to doing that game, like, I have fun in it, don't get me wrong. But it's like, I have all these other things that I have a lot more fun, like, you know, recording. And Okami has this fun too, but it's, just, it's not in the same tier as the uh, the other shit that I play. If someone said, would you rather do Elder Scrolls Oblivion videos or Okami, I would probably do Elder Scrolls videos. But if someone said, oh, would you rather play Tack or Okami, I would rather play Okami. If someone said Ratchet and Clank or Okami, I'd probably say Ratchet and Clank. Shadow of a Colossus or Okami? Shadow of Colossus. Much damage they do with their uh, ultimate move, but okay. My name, yeah. We have another run back here. Let's go see if these guys are respawn or not. I mean, either way, I'm on a very imperialistic playthrough right now. Just, just today, I'm like, I want to go everywhere. I want to conquer everything. Just death. Like, death should be in my wake. And if it is not, I will feel less of a person. Uh. Okay. Let's see. I think I saw some beetle things over that way. And then there's something down on the end of this little mid castle. Right, man, plant again. Well, I swore I saw something up there. What the. Oh, the, the clouds rotate with the camera. Wow. Oh, that one stays. Oh, no, it doesn't. They're moving, though. So that's kind of realistic. But the fact that they move with the camera, like I said, it's following our character. And we're the only thing that's making the world change. Kind of feels kind of eh. That's why I like real-time games, much like with the Ark or Skyrim Oblivion. Dragon Age, like every last bit feels alive. Let's see, these guys are here. Let's see. I haven't quite checked the uh, side area of this section yet. Also, uh, what happens if I stand on one of these? Oh, uh, Orc Caves, what? That's probably going to teleport me somewhere. I, I don't want that because I might reload my whole area here. Oh, I see these sons of bitches. Motherfuckers. But. Uh. Ah, oh, shit. Heal. Fight. Come again. I've got a little level we got there, too. I seem to do better when I walk to my left. When I shoot. Weird. Oh well. Let's get that. Alright. Let's see. I think I've been trying to invest into that. But let's see. What's this? Zoom in on an enemy when charging a bow shot by pressing R3. It requires a Sneaking makes enemies aware of you later than usual. Zeal, uh, firebolt, ugh. Like, I'll worry about that maybe when we, uh, do the other shit. It looks like this just does, uh, this actually boosts health, which is kind of neat. So I guess after, um, after these three, our kind of opposites are all kind of, just these two are health. You know, we can get a lot more health if we do stealth. 
So yeah, boom, we fucking maximize that. Hell yeah. Nice. So yeah, the only way to get it higher now, let me actually look at that again, is through this skill and this precision thing. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to level um, like each of these together. Or maybe I can just get that first skill here. Or not precision, but stealth. Yep, because this, this... Oh, they actually have co co cause more range combat damage and survive more damage. Ooh! So this thing actually goes pretty damn far. And all I, all I see so there's like the I, I, the numbers up above. I wonder what those were. I never really focused on that, but like each slot is like, you know, like the, the magic is activated at level 4 for some reason. But, you know, overall I'm like, I'm level 13, which doesn't really make sense, but I understand what they're going for. That's all that matters. Yeah. But looks like though they are keeping away the enemies I have killed, so that's cool. Yeah, we'll take advantage of that. Get all the XP we can get. Get all the loot. Make the good money. And it seems like I'm better at finding those bugs when I got my weapon out. See one of those beetles. Sub bitch. But yeah, we definitely cleared out this side of the island too. I'm like a fucking executioner today, man. It's crazy. Nice. Then we keep having that Todd Howard little logo pop up. <laughs> like I know it's my character, but like that little logo, the way they had drew the character's face, like kinda weird. It just looks like Todd Howard. Unless then maybe they did that as a parody like when they made this game, because like maybe they knew about Oblivion and they just said, Oh, let's make the main character in our game, Todd Howard. You know, that's a fucking great idea. Yeah, you know, fucking oi manoi. Let's see. Let's get this one now. Shimmer me timbers. Oh no, a huge bug approaches me. Whatever will I do? It's not like I have strong weapons or nothing. What? Wow. <laughs> wow. Okay. Let's see if I can ignore this guy for a bit here. Yeah, don't mind me. Just getting out of sight. So it seems like when you pull enemies kind of far away, they just they re teleport back to the spawn point. Because, you know, they, I guess they know that you're trying to tease them in some regard. Ha. <laughs> Little ragdoll, too. <sighs> Alright. Let's get this. Got a good amount of ammo, which is nice. Kinda wandered to my heart's content. Ah! Wolfies. Nice oh, son of a bitch. Stupid plants in the way. Huh? <laughs> it's casual. Oh shit. Oh, you think your charge up is gonna help you? <laughs> no, thanks for the free shot, asshole. I'm so no messages from my woman. That's fine. Let's go back to that stopwatch then. Yep, it's been 34 minutes. We'll probably stop recording around like maybe 50 minutes or something like that. Yeah, just just enough time to kind of mess around enough. Let's get that bow back out. I don't trust this shit. I still wish they would let me climb up mountains and stuff. Like, I would like to see everything for what it is. You know, kind of get a gist of my own surroundings. But nope. They don't like that kind of freedom in this game. They limit you to whatever area you can normally walk through. Because if you try to, they do like this little like vibration thing. And then they keep you from moving from where you are. 
It's pretty dumb. Just kill me some wolf. <laughs> the other one I didn't even shoot that much, just the sword was just so strong. And we got floating trees. Amazing. Yeah, I'm gassy today. Must be that combination of pizza and uh, uh the sauce. Did my arrow just shoot off in whatever direction the enemy closest to me was? I mean, that's a little bit of a turn off, but... Oh, shit. There's that vibration that I was talking about. Ow. Ow. Did a double attack without even touching me. Asshole. But yeah, that stupid vibration crap almost got me killed. Asshole. Yeah, if, if my character would have been uncontrollable that whole time, I would have been gone. Like, sure, I could heal. Actually, I don't even think you can heal during that. Kind of think of it. So, leave. So, is there any way I could just kind of... Ooh! See, like I said, they do let you explore in some regard, but, like, not quite at all. Like, we might be able to go into that water, maybe not. Last time I swam, I died. And it made me reload my save. Kind of dumb. Uh, but yep. Let's go head back. I actually want to check if there is a respawn right back at where we started. If they're still gone for sure, then we would definitely head around and go back onto the other side here and kill those guys. But yep, I might be shutting the video soon though, because I want to use the restroom. I don't want to be doing a major fight and then be having the, the need to relieve myself. You know, I haven't made an accident ever in my life ever since I was a baby, probably. But I would like to keep that record. <laughs> you know, I'm not going to be one to piss myself when I'm trying to play a game. So I'm not even a fat dude either. So, like, you know, if this happens now, I'm going to have problems down the road. Like, it may be possible for when I'm an old man, but. Looking pretty clear out here. I'll take that, thank you. Yeah, last time though there was an ogre patrol, there was um multiple bugs, there was the beetles too. All kinds of shit. Does he have anything new to say? Nope. We still haven't gotten this caboose either. There's an ogre leaf. Okay. See, so you have two beetles here. I'm not sure what else. Is. Oh, yeah, we got some goblin looking things. Probably the same as these guys here. Well, yeah, let's go take out the beetles at least, and then I'll probably save my game and we'll stop there. I might even just spend a little bit of time just uploading shit too. But then again, I don't know if reloading my game might respawn these guys or not, but I suppose we'll see. But yeah, let's just do my normal business as we usually do. Mm -hmm. One more arrow shot. Slash. I just love how they're so dumbfounded when you slash them. You're just like, I can't move. I am confundled. Whatever will I do? I'm just a humble beetle. Now we slash. Seems like that one, two, three. Oh, here it comes. Nice. I knew that finisher was coming. I was like, oh, he's definitely going to be running from me because he did that teleport thing. But hell yeah, we fucking timed it perfectly. That was cool. Like, we, we did that by accident the first time, but now I kind of got the gist of like what to do and shit. So that's cool. I'll be able to just look around here. This is kind of the midsection of from where I did kind of element execution run versus not yep so yeah i will go use the restroom and uh we shall return so i'm gonna go put myself at a fairly decent place in this case if there is a respawn rate for logging back into the game 
or like reloading your save, whatever you want to call it. Log in, reload. Uh, games are different nowadays. Let's see what he has to say real quick. Yeah, no skaboos, hoi minoi. And before we do anything else, I just want to double check what all I got. See if there's anything new I gotta put on. No. I mean, we got these special quest items, so which is cool. But yeah, peace, guys. What a noise.